Alzheimer's cured, students downloading the test answers to their brains, people who have been paralyzed for decades finally being able to walk again, cryptocurrency fanatics and Final Stand fans downloading entire books on how to mine Dogecoin, the future cryptocurrency of Earth to our brains in only seconds, kids in wheelchairs being able to stand for the first time in their entire lives. Imagine you have a paralyzed daughter. Every day you take care of her because you love her more than anything, but it breaks your heart that you have to watch her struggle with not being able to do a lot of the things that other kids can do. After careful consideration, you decide to give Neuralink a chance. You don't know what to expect. She goes into the operating room and comes out only hours later. Everything seems normal, but this could be the start of something huge. For the first time in a long time, you have hope. A few months go by and she has been working hard every day going to physical therapy. Finally, the day comes when it is time for her to try walking for the first time. That funny little chip in her brain is bypassing the connective issue and allowing her to control her legs. She begins to stand up as tears fill your eyes. Then it happens. Her first step, another one. Then another one after that, it almost seems too good to be true. She was going to have to be in a wheelchair her entire life, but now everything, it feels different. She can walk and, and stand and play like every other kid now. You know it will take time to fully get back and fully get to the way things should be, but everything is going to be okay now. That may seem like a dream, but thanks to one man, we could only be years away from it actually becoming a reality. My name is Matt Wallace, and in this mini-documentary, we are going to dive straight into Neuralink. Elon Musk is blazing the path forward for humanity. Despite already being the richest man in the world, he still works harder than most people could imagine. Every day, putting in long hours and proving that he deserves to be where he is today. He also just gave a major Neuralink update that I'm about to show you in this mini-documentary. It started in 2016, when Elon founded the company with 8 people using $100 million of his own money. As you know, Elon is not someone who moves slowly, so they hit the ground running extremely fast. By 2017, they were already discovering potential ways to treat brain disease. On top of that, they also begin work on the potential to control body parts using Neuralink electronic robotic body parts that will allow people who cannot do certain things to be able to do those things. Six million dollar man is one thing, but how about having many of those same benefits at a significantly lower cost than six million dollars? There is a reason that a lot of what is going on with Neuralink is very secretive. It's because it is groundbreaking stuff. Think for a sec what the world was like just 25 years ago. There were no smartphones. You couldn't pull out a device from your pocket and immediately access an entire world of information. If you went back in time and told people that only a few decades later, they would be able to drive their electric sports cars to go watch reusable rockets that can take off and land again while showing a friend alive over FaceTime with a small rectangle, they would first ask you what the heck is FaceTime, and then they would proceed with assuming you were crazy. It makes sense though, to be honest. Nobody even thought about most of those things back then, partially because they may have seemed impossible and partially because nobody even understood how they could potentially change the world. Now let's think about 25 years from now using the same logic. There are almost certainly going to be things that you would think someone was crazy if they talked about them now. It is easy to assume that we can fully predict them, but the truth is that we can only try our best. So here's me doing that. These are five things that I think we may see 25 years from now. Millions of people choosing to replace their perfectly good or faulty body parts with robotic ones that offer specific advantages. Most of the diseases that burden us as we age being cured or preventable. The average human lifespan will be over 100 years old, which is kind of weird to think about, considering how big of a jump that will be in only 25 years. But I think it is absolutely possible, considering all of the advancement and how fast we are seeing it right now. Those are five of the most advanced things I can think of, and the crazy thing is that if they come true, Elon Musk will likely have played a large role 
in pretty much all of them. Elon may have a decent amount of haters, but it is easy to see why he has way more people who love him. The big update with Neuralink is that Elon officially announced human trials may start this year. Real human beings getting a chip implanted in their brain, and we won't even have to wait very long to see it happen. Normally advancements in the medical world take decades, but if you have a genius billionaire at the helm, clearly that's no longer the case. Perhaps even one of us will be participating in the trials. They have done some advanced tests with pigs, and overall they went pretty well, but can we be sure that it's safe? Would you be willing to try it? I know I wouldn't be willing to try it yet. Eventually, maybe I would, but it's kind of scary and there's a lot of factors there that you don't really know what to expect with. Overall, this is a very positive thing that the test went well, and I'm, I'm really looking forward to seeing the future test as we go on, because I do think eventually there will come a time when all of us can look at it and say, okay, that's pretty safe, but we are still a bit away from being there. I'm definitely excited to keep you updated here on this channel. We are really just scratching the surface of what Neuralink may be capable of down the line. Perhaps there are even a ton of incredible benefits that will provide that we don't even know about yet. Let's make a deal though. I will say something nice about Dogecoin, something very nice at the beginning of this video for all the new people who are watching me for the first time. Putting it at the beginning of the video because many of them will not make it this far. Since you did though, I imagine you may be a fan of Elon Musk like me who likely has some money invested in Dogecoin. I have not even put the Dogecoin part in the script yet at the time I am writing this part of the script. But by now, you've probably already heard it at the beginning of the video, so make sure to press like to help get the good words about Dogecoin to land in more people's minds who have not heard about it yet. The fact that you are watching this all the way through will also help it to get recommended to more people. Maybe even have a friend or family member that you're thinking about in your mind right now who would probably like this video and maybe you'll send them a link, maybe you won't, it's really up to you. But I've been watching YouTube since I was a kid and it is very hard to get me to subscribe, especially with the notifications on. That said, if I had just watched this video as someone who's never seen one of my videos before, I honestly would subscribe to the channel and put those notifications on. I appreciate it when a lot of time and effort is put into videos and hopefully you guys can see that that was the case with this one. If you did decide to subscribe, welcome to the community and I look forward to making more interesting content for you in the future. Perhaps even 25 years into the future, think about how crazy it will be to watch one of my live streams directly in your brain decades from now and think back to this day long ago when you randomly stumbled across a video and decided to subscribe. By the way, I apologize in advance for waking you up with that brain notification for my video. Bomb